Today I'm going to be showing you how to set up a gaming setup using a projector and Samsung Dex. I have over here this projector. This is an Ujeri projector home theater. I'm going to be using it to set up Android gaming using my Samsung S23 Ultra. You could actually do this with any device that supports Samsung Dex. In the description, I'm going to be putting in a couple of devices that support this kind of setup. I'll be making use of this device. This is an Anker Power Expand Plus. Uh, it actually has a, it's a 7 in 1 USB C connector. And you would actually need something like this to connect to your gaming controller. So I have this. This is a micro USB cord. You would also need a HDMI cable. So I have this HDMI cable to enable me set this up and i also have this auxiliary cable so i have over here a vizio soundbar uh, in another one of my videos i actually showed how to set up this soundbar so i'm going to be connecting this setup to this vizio soundbar for the sound that we're going to be receiving from this gaming setup you could check in my videos to see where i actually did the unboxing of this vizio v21 soundbar for this setup you would need a controller you could actually use a xbox controller or a playstation controller any one of them is gonna work but i'm gonna be using the xbox for this demonstration i have over here my wireless logitech mouse which i'm gonna be using as well so let's get down to it This Oderi projector actually comes along with a remote. It comes along with your power cable. And over here is the projector. It's actually a lightweight projector. So over here, I also have this laptop stand. Uh, you could use anything that inclines to help you stand this projector. On this side of the projector, you have a HDMI port and two USB ports over here. We're going to be connecting the HDMI cable to the HDMI port over here. And over here we have the AV and we have this. This is like a port for your auxiliary cable. So I'm going to be connecting the output from the auxiliary cable over here to my soundbar, okay? You have the focus. This is like the focus wheel. This helps you to focus your projection and you also have this you have the keystone you actually use this to help sharpen your image all right let's see what's on this side on this side of the projector we have where the power cable goes in if you want to do a connection with a vga cable you could actually do that here all right so let's go ahead and connect our cables Gonna be connecting my wireless mouse in here and i'm gonna be connecting my gaming controller in the other usb port i have my hdmi over here my wireless mouse and my gaming controller the usb type c cable actually goes to the phone for a seamless gaming connection using your phone it will be a great idea to do some settings on the phone before plugging it up you go to settings you come over here to sound and vibration you go to separate app sound if you set this up your gaming will not be interrupted if you receive any calls or other notification you would be able to separate the sound of your game from the sound of your notification you come over here to where you have app you select app and under the app you select all the games 
apps. So you could have your Bluetooth device and on your Bluetooth device you could receive your calls and your text message notifications and your gaming would actually be channeled to your soundbar. You could do it vice versa, whichever works best for you. Come over here to audio device and the audio device you could either select your Bluetooth device or you could select your phone. So for the gaming, the gaming is going to be going through the phone. So that way I can actually stream it to the soundbar. Okay, so I have my phone connected here. And this is what the setting looks like. So it's a very simple setup. Your projector, your Android phone, your gaming controller and your USB Type-C extension ports. So I connect the other end of my auxiliary cable to my soundbar. It's in there. I power on the projector using the remote. The projector comes up. I'm going to be showing you like a couple of settings you could do. If you want to work on the settings, you could always come over here. You tap on this key and you'll be able to work on the settings. The settings you have over here, you could change the picture mode. Change the color temperature, the aspect ratio, the noise reduction. You could also change the direction of your projection and also the display size. Okay. If you come this way, you have sound settings, which you could also work on for your projector. You have the sleep timer. You have these other settings you have over here. So once you're done with all of these, the back key brings you back to this screen. Okay. Once you're on this screen, you could make use of your mouse and open up all the apps you have on your phone. So I go over to the game that I intend to use for the demonstration. I, I click on it and it opens up.
so let's try another game and see how it looks like. I hope you enjoyed this video and you found it useful. If you did, kindly leave a like. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next video.